Hi everyone, Alan here from the Alan Kane's Daily Blog YouTube channel. Yeah, I'd like to give a big massive shout out to all the usual crowd. And yeah, on this channel, uh, on this channel, I've been putting out that Blackburn isn't getting anywhere. Well, they've started. Well, they're finishing off the house, the housing developments in Mill Hill. But Mill Hill has always been a rough, a rough area. And yeah, what can I say? I'm hoping that they've uh, got wheelchair access to the platforms at the railway station because the railway, the, rail, the only accessible uh, railway station is Cherry Tree and Pleasanton, which is a bit of a pain in the pain in the ass to get to. Um, is Blackburn failing? I really do think so. Um, they are putting, there are one or two uh, shops being built in the Blackburn area uh, near to the Chippery and one, one used to be an arcade, Campbell's Arcade. Well, the major problem is with Blackburn the amount of retailers that are here are basically dying. Um, in the case is that it's going to be pound shops. It's going to be pound shop. Pound shop land. And that's what's that's what's major is a major thing. That the that the type of shop type of shops that we're going to end up getting is a bit of a mess. Also, whilst I'm on, do you have a bank account? This is one of the other subjects that I'm going to touch on. Do you have a bank account? If so, if so, my advice to you is is that you should split split your bank whatever's in your bank account to different banks because I'm going to tell you something in, in a in a bit there is something going to be happening very soon lots of banks are pulling are pulling people's credit and it's just one of those things that happened it start it started in the united it started in the united states but there are a few us based banks that are here and they started pulling people's credit. So if you have anything outstanding, anything outstanding, credit cards, loans, mortgages, whatever, try and get free of your stuff. Pay it off if you can because they will basically are basically stopping your um, access to cash so because it, it's already happened over here Tesco Bank 
Day Gov. You've got till November. Yes, November to get your money out of Tesco Bank. Because if you don't, if you don't, they're going to keep it for themselves and use it to pay off debt that they own. They're going to use your money to pay off their debt. So, if you have money in Tesco Bank, go, go to your account, empty it, and find somewhere else. But just don't just have that one account. Split it up. Because I think this is going to be a big thing that a lot of a lot of banks are not going to give you cre give you credit or a credit line so you know that's what they're going to do and eventually there'll be fewer 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 and fewer and fewer bank branches as well because they're turning around and saying that they're not people aren't using them but that's just an excuse they're doing it for a particular re one particular reason and that's overhead and once they get that once they get that certain amount of overhead it's bye bye branch and it's going to get messy now the other thing I was going to mention is Blackburn is Blackburn failing it is and I must say it is because I've been hearing that Salford Salford and Manchester areas have been uh, shall we say they've been given quite a fair bit of money and uh, there are a number also a number of Chinese investors coming into the area and you know investing money there so what's going to happen there well I'll tell you what's going to happen there they're putting high-rise apartments up and Preston has just got it got in got in on the act slightly they're building a 15-story tower block is it going to be the first is it going to be the first of many new what new developments in the city center we don't know because I haven't been uh, privileged to find out what's going on um, I know Blackpool is getting quite a few uh, new buildings, but a lot of their buildings need replacing. They're worn out. And this morning, this morning, I got some, I got some news from Merseyside. Well, in Merseyside, we have a fit place called Pontins Holiday Park, and. They also have um, Britannia, Hot Britannia Hotels. And Britannia Hotels own several hotels in the, t in, the t in the town. But the major problem is Britannia Hotels are, sl are slum hotel lords. Yeah. They've only just had outside the Norbrecht Castle, because they own that, painted repainted but but that's just one thing that they've had done um, Blackpool Council has actually turned around and said they've got to they have to have planning perm planning permission for uh, these new Afghan refugees to come to their come to their premises so yeah 
Right, back to Blackburn to see what, and, t- and I'll tell you what's, I'll tell you what I think is going to happen. I think Blackburn is basically is go- is going to um, lose a lot of jobs, especially if especially if the new development uh, comes across on the Fuertes on the Fuertes side. There is a rumour that the Fuertes site, the old Fuertes site, is going to be redeveloped, redeveloped as a as a mixed purpose, and and there's going to be uh, retail and residential there. We'll just have to wait and see and see what happens with that. And, and if that does, if that does happen, that's going to give the mal a kick, a kick in the teeth. And plus, Blackburn has n- a various number of retail parks on the outskirts of the town, uh, such as Whitebirk, and you've got the development, you've got uh, Shadowless Road, and what else? You've got. The uh, next Asda, and yeah, that's gone. But that's he got the retail park there, <coughs> Lower Audley Retail Park, park which is run, I can't try to think what's uh, it's run by, but it'll come back to me. That is basically knocking the snot out of uh, the town centre um, Peel Holdings that's it well those types of places are going to start knocking the snot out of the town centre right. you're right. yeah so you know not so bad yeah so what I'm going to do I'm going to end the uh, video for now and uh, say bye for now So it's three, two, one, click.